What's up, everybody? Today is going to be a big game playing against last year's champions of France, Asvel Villebron. If you don't know, that team is like a EuroLeague team, one of the biggest budget teams in the league. Normally, them and Monaco have the top budget, so their budget probably quadruple our budget, and that's what we face tonight. So it's going to be a very interesting game, and I have to get prepared, but it should be fun. Now, it's going to be interesting because this is a different scenario. We were the best team in Pro B for the last couple of years, which is the second division in France. They've been a, one of the best teams in the first division for the last couple of years. So we've been the hunted in the second division, and they've been the hunted in the first division. So... It's gonna feel good to finally be the hunter, to finally be able to punch somebody in the mouth. Because games like this, what happens is, the team with the bigger budget normally think that the game is won before the game. So the team with the smaller budget get a chance to punch them in the mouth. And we are gonna have a chance to punch them in the mouth tonight, give it our all, see what we got, see what happens. So I'm walking to the front of the street, going to catch my ride because I don't have a car. Well, I have a car, but I don't have a permit to drive. It's a crazy rule in France that after one year, you can't use your driver's license. You can't use the international driver's license. You have to get a French permit. It's not crazy, I understand. I'm just mad because it's affecting me right now. So I gotta catch a ride to practice every day or take the bike. Looks like Looks like I just got a new package I think that's my microphone uh, I've been waiting on the microphone for about two weeks It's a lapel mic So that I can get Better audio Shout out to my point guard uh, I got time, he come picks me up. So I can try to make an effort and walk as close to his house as possible so that I don't be an inconvenience for him because I was the guy that used to pick up people for work, for uh, practice and stuff, and I hated it, to be honest with you. So I know how he may feel, but as you can see, it's an overcast day. It's kind of chilly, it might rain. So it's not practical for me to take my bike. Here goes Tom right here. This is him. He's flying. <laughs> I'm back on YouTube. Tom Connolly. I appreciate it. <laughs> it's gonna be a man character on the channel. On my face. On my face. <laughs> And yo, it's about to be crazy. And so me and Tom about to prank the coach today. Cause it's his birthday. Yeah. Hopefully somebody films it and I can get it on the vlog. And I'll show y'all. We about to go to shoot around. See y'all later. The team fight prank worked well on the coach. I think he kind of knew. I, I, I tried to hold my laugh, but Georgie, my guy, Georgie, he just kept giving me this smirk and I couldn't hold it in. Tom hit me with a weak ass push. So I had to 
improvise my fall to make it seem more realistic, but it looked worse. It looked like a flop, but we had a big team fight. Coach was laughing after he smiled, and you know, we told him happy birthday. So long as he's smiling, job got done. So right now, I think I'm about to edit a video, pass some time. I don't want to just sit on the couch all day because you know, we don't play until 8 o'clock at night. Wifey back in town, you know what I'm saying? She back home. But yeah, I just try to stay active and do stuff until it's time to play, watch some film, watch our last game, and get ready to go tonight. So Wifey's in the room. She's working with her clients on fitness. She has online fitness classes. So if you hear her in the background, don't mind her. Um, I gotta film this video because I'm about to eat lunch. I normally eat my lunch around one o'clock, it's actually 12.50 right now. Today I'm having pasta, some beef pasta. She cooked it with this bow tie pasta. Big secret, I don't really like it. But it gives me the carbs I need, the energy I need. I'm gonna eat this and I'll probably go and take me a nap. I normally take about a 20, 30 minute nap. After that, I watch some film from the last game, then I watch some film from the team that we played tonight, and I probably just watch Kobe Bryant film for the rest of the day while I get on the Air Relax, which is like another version of a Normatec, just a little bit less expensive. Do the same thing, but that's what my game day is looking like this year, and my wife is getting louder as I speak, but <laughs> it's all good. About to chow down on this food, continue with my day. So here's a little game day drama. I typically have game day dramas. Things typically don't go well for me on game day. I have a plan, I have something set out and something always tend to go wrong. Wifey made some pasta, but I think she might've dropped the salt in the sauce. It's way too salty. I can't, I barely could eat it. Um, she, this is normally one of her better meals, but she dropped the ball on this one. <laughs> so I'm about to try to order some food to get in and I'm gonna see where I'm gonna go. They have a burger place. That's a grill place. So I might just get a burger and some fries. Hopefully that keep me going, but yeah. It's, it's always something. Food is freezing cold, but we'll make it do what it do, baby. I'm about to eat this food. Take one. was crazy I didn't really have time to record so finishing the video of the following day and man what a what a win last night big win against one of the top teams in France um, we came out we fought we came out we played excellent we played amazing they didn't bring much energy I'm not sure if they didn't really take us serious but I told you we get a chance to punch some people in the mouth this season. So that was round one. <laughs> so we're going to have to play them again. I'm sure they're going to be very motivated next time. But we actually have another game coming up in a few days. So we have to really gear down and get ready for the next game. For me personally, it was a rough night. Um, started the game off, kind of got dunked on, but um, trying to block an alley-oop. I think that my finger, my pinky finger, let me see it. Yeah, my pinky finger got jammed and um, it led to a big, a, a large amount of swelling on the inside of my finger and around the knuckle area. 
to where I couldn't even flex my finger and I couldn't even shoot, definitely couldn't dribble. It was even tough to catch passes, so that was tough. So I played a couple of more minutes with that finger. I felt like I could have fight through that pain a little bit, but then I twisted my ankle. Um, just a freak accident, nothing really serious, but trying to be aggressive on defense and I just rolled my foot. I tried to hurry up and get up and be quick, like, okay, gotta get back and keep on playing defense, but I realized I couldn't really put pressure on it. So, got out of the game, I tried to rehab it in the back and it was tough. I'm not one to play with tape. I'm not one that like to take anti-inflammatories. I'm one that like to deal with injuries a little more natural. I feel like if I gotta put tape on an injury, that means I shouldn't be playing. So if I can't do it without tape, why would I do it with tape? Um, so today, um, I just focused on getting myself rehab, you know, going through certain motions, seeing if I can sprint, seeing if I can jump. And I can sprint, I can jump. I still have some power in there. I mean, it's not 100%, but it's good enough to play. Um, I got an x-ray tomorrow for my finger. I'm not sure how that's gonna go because the finger is still kind of painful, but it's probably just a big sprain too. But we going to get an x-ray to make sure that it's not nothing more serious than what it is. But um, but besides that, yeah, man, like I said, big W. Uh, great for our team, great for the city, great for our confidence. We on for the next one against Paris Basketball. And yeah, man, thank you guys for tuning in. Um, like I said, I'm putting out as much content as possible. So remember, every day, make them pay. And until next time, I'm out. Thank you.